Hello everyone, welcome to Common American Idioms and Expressions. This will be lesson number three. And FYI, you will find the text in the description below, also linked to lesson one and two. Our first four idioms will reference playing cards. First idiom, call a spade a spade. Speaking bluntly, telling the truth in a very blunt manner. Example, I wish you would just call a spade a spade and tell me what you don't like about my idea. From the game of poker, we have call someone's bluff. That means you challenge someone. A sentence, I called his bluff and he admitted he had made up the whole story. Card up one sleeve, an extra secret plan to employ in case of an issue. Example, you can trust Mary. She always has a card up her sleeve. Now we have not playing with a full deck. And this means somebody's not totally there mentally. Sometimes I think Rob is not playing with a full deck. Now we have open a can of worms, and that means creating a complicated situation or problem. Example, asking her about their breakup, well, that will just open a can of worms. Can't see the forest for the trees. Overly concerned with details and missing the obvious. Example. I'm afraid you can't see the forest for the trees when it comes to this issue. Cat got your tongue? Can't you speak? Can't you give an explanation? Example, what's the matter? Cat got your tongue. I want you to explain why you did that. Cross your T's and dot your I's. Be very careful and precise. Let's put that in a sentence. Be sure to cross your T's and dot your I's on your application. They will do a background check. Wise as an owl. Somebody very intelligent, very smart. Example, my teacher is as wise as an owl. Better late than never means it's better to be late than never show up at all. Example, better late than never, I got stuck in traffic, but I am here now. A knight in shining armor, a good and helpful person. You are my knight in shining armor. I would have failed the test without your help. You can say that again. This is something that needs or bears repeating. Example, we need more kind people in the world. You can say that again. No rhyme or reason it means it doesn't really make sense why something is happening. He quit his job for no rhyme or reason. He was really doing well there. to be sadder, but wiser. And this is learning something through a painful experience. Example, he never paid me my money back. Well, I'm a little sadder, but wiser, but I know I will never loan him money again. Last but not least, to sum up in conclusion, last but not least, I want to thank everyone for watching this video please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Please take the quiz.